What's the best trading session that you should be at your computer? It's a question that a lot of people ask and I've got a real simple answer for you. So let's get into that and more right now. Hey there traders, Andrew Mitchum here at the Forex Trading Coach with video and podcast number 506. Wanted to come outside, glorious afternoon. We are just a handful of days away from the shortest day of the year and we're getting weather like this. So you've got to take advantage of being outside and enjoying some good uh, vitamin D from the sun. Uh, so trading sessions, uh, actually the sun relates to this quite a lot because I've just been on a Zoom call with a guy over in Oregon, over in the US on the west coast of Oregon. Uh, west coast of the US and he said to me hey Andrew um, I'm always concerned about when to trade the sessions because for him the US session uh, because he's on the west coast and uh, and like you know the morning session opens in New York time on the east coast uh, you know it's quite a considerable time zone difference there and he said to me I can't trade the US morning session even though he's in the same country because you know it means getting up at like three four o'clock in the morning and it's just not practical likewise he cannot trade the European session because that's like 11 12 you know midnight one o'clock in the morning depending on time of year for him so he said look what do I do because it's always something that's concerned him and I said look fantastic question really good answer for you and you're going to love it the fact is um i won't tell you his name but i said look the fact is you don't need to worry about sessions when you trade the way that we trade because we look at the close of a candle it doesn't matter to me what the time of the day is it doesn't matter what the session we might be in or leading up to it really does not matter you look at the close of a candle and you see the trade take the trade from there so you know, first of all, when to go and look at your charts because it's at the close of that candle. But like I said to him, the thing is, if you look at the 5 p.m. New York close of day charts, and for him, that might be like two o'clock in the afternoon and I'm at work and, you know, I, I can't trade then. Um, could have been a, an answer, you know, he could have said. Um, my reply was, well, it doesn't matter again because we use limit orders to place our trades. So if you don't place your trade till five, six, seven o'clock in the evening for him, which is, you know, like sort of three, four, five, six hours after the uh, close of day at 5 p.m. New York time, it doesn't matter because at that time of the day, very little happens anyway. We're at the end of the um, U.S. session time, um, you know, we're at the start of New Zealand, Australia and into the Asian session, nothing happens on most days. So it really doesn't matter if you're not there at that exact time. So in other words, it doesn't matter where you live in the world. Don't worry about sessions. Trade the close of a candle, use limit orders, and you'll enjoy your trading much, much more. You don't need to be setting your alarm clock. Look, I used to do it years ago when I started. I used to think I used to need to be up for the US session and it was like, you know, sort of one o'clock in the morning or something. And it's like crazy. You can do it for a week or two, but you're not going to do it um, consistently. And ultimately, it matters not one bit once you know what you're doing. So I completely changed my trading around, made it far more enjoyable. For me, I can go out and do things like this, get outside in the sun, enjoy, um, you know, enjoy doing other things than sitting watching charts all day. Um, trading is about quality. It's about getting um, the quality of your trades, your consistency of your trades and the consistency of your trade setups. Another example, which I shared with the same guy today, um, I said, look, we post our daily trades every single day, which we do. And we've done since 2010. Um, today, there were none. And it, it's like, well, there were no specific daily chart trades for today. Therefore, don't force trades, don't take any. I'm sure there'll be some other shorter time frame charts setting up, you know, later today. There probably will be. But simply because there were no trades on the daily charts, don't worry about it. If there's none there, don't take any. Tomorrow, there'll probably be five or six. So, you know, you, you, you make hay when the sun shines. Again, back to that sun. It's good for you, the sun. Um, so I uh, hope that helps. Look, if you're out there looking for a good broker, I can highly recommend Blueberry Markets over in Australia. Uh, great brokerage, MT4, MT5 platform. The MT5 platform has um, obviously more time frame charts because MT5 does that, but also you've got the ability to trade other markets as well, you know, the non Forex markets as well, which we're finding some great setups on. Uh, so it's really important that you you have a system and a strategy that allows you to trade all these different markets not just the forex market if you want to trade those other you know those metals indices cryptos etc 
then um, blueberry markets are a fantastic place to go. And if you want to trade those, make sure you have a strategy that works equally as well on those other markets. So hope that helps. This is Andrew Mitchum here at the Forest Trading Coach. Enjoying the sunshine, enjoying winter. Can't believe we're just a few days away from the shortest day of the year. Um, absolutely beautiful. So I hope you're having a good time where you are and I'll see you this time next week. Bye for now.